One Direction came to SNL. <laughs> Nobody cared. <laughs> It was so funny. We did a shoot with them. It was 200 extra girls, and it was One Direction. As soon as the girls saw One Direction, they just lost it. They lost it. They were like, ah! I was like, y'all are 11. You shouldn't be touching yourselves like that. <laughs> Feeling very uncomfortable right now. They got escorted out. One Direction leaves. I went to where the 200 girls were standing. I kid you not, y'all. It smelled just like farts. <laughs> Do you know what that means? That means they were so excited to meet One Direction, they almost <laughs> themselves. Now, that's a different type of fame for your ass. I know about famous, but not <laughs> famous, right? I ain't never had somebody come up to me and be like, hey, J. Farrell. <sighs> You're the best, <laughs> you. You're so amazing. And I get sad, you know? Cause I see entertainers who I think deserve that type of notoriety and they don't get it. Like Trey Songz. I think Trey Songz should be a lot bigger than he is, you know what I mean? He's one of the only entertainers I know that can sit there, I molest your girlfriend, while you watch helplessly and there's nothing you can do but be like, yo, that's Trey Songz, he's I molesting my woman, I'm probably gonna sleep with her and that's awesome. <laughs> Matter of fact, give me a female volunteer out the audience right now. I'm gonna show you what he does. You, you wanna come up here? Come on, Karen, get up here. Come on. That's right. <laughs> you gotta sit down. <laughs> you look happy as <laughs> <laughs> Hi, everybody. <laughs> okay. If you don't know what Trey Songz is, this is what he does. He'd be. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Look what the girl done did to me. <laughs> you a little too into this shit. All right, that ain't that type of party, ma'am. Thank you so much. <laughs> she was like, she was like, what's next? What? <laughs> <I'm so laughs> but look, it's a few entertainers who got that power, okay? It's like, there's another dude that can do that. Chris Brown. Yep, y'all gotta give it up for Chris Brown. Come on, dog. why y'all ain't clapping, man? Come on, why y'all ain't clapping? It's not like he hit y'all, what the hell? He's an all-around entertainer. He can sing, he can dance, pop lock, box just a little bit. Um, okay, I know he was in a situation with Rihanna, okay? And that's in the past. And folks, you know people's love. You can't help who you love. You just can't. You can't help who you love. Some women love their man so much, even whatever situation they are in, they make up excuses for them. Girl, this is the circle of trust. No, that's the black eye. Go get that checked out. <laughs> That's terrible. And fellas, I ain't condoning. You should not put your hands on a woman. You should not do that, okay? If you do that, you should be ashamed of yourself because that's sick. <laughs> Violence isn't funny all the time. Sometimes it's hilarious. Like every time we hear that Drake gets in a fight. <laughs> you're like, dude, you're not a fighter. You're a stalker. That's what the hell you are. Listen to his lyrics, listen to his lyrics and tell me the man not a stalker. He be, I can't get over you. You left your mark on me. I'm like, what, you got him in the basement or something? <laughs> like he's just driving around in a random white van just picking up innocent women just, oh yeah, she looks good. Ah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Get in the car, get in the car, get in the car. Just hold on, we going home. 